Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Tuesday's uh, body weight uh, hit slash circuit slash conditioning, whatever else. Um, this one today is just going to be one continual round. We've done one of these before. Uh, there's going to be 21 exercises today. The last exercise is uh, a one minute finisher, but we'll get on to that shortly. Um, every exercise is done for 40 seconds and you have a 20 second rest in between. It's a mixture of uh, cardio and obviously abs and toning as well. So really important that when we do the uh, abs section and this workout, you don't want to be going fast unless obviously I instruct you to do so. I really want you to go nice and slow and nice and controlled in the, in the ab and toning section because that way you'll feel the time and the tension on the core and obviously you'll get far more benefit from it than going flat out if you need to on the exercises, okay? So the uh, cardio exercises, again, they want to be flat out because we're trying to uh, increase your heart rate and get it up to where it needs to be. And then obviously we slow it down when we do the core exercises, okay? So it's a mixture of everything. Um, as always, guys, please let me know what you think of it. Again, all these ones I make up, I just um, you know change the exercises here and there. Um, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna do the warm up, and then once we've done the warm up, we're gonna go through probably about three or four of the exercises, um, because trying to explain it in a 20 second rest in between each one, it's gonna be pretty tough when I'm blowing out my backside. So um, what I want you guys to do is um, obviously go along with it as much as you can. The timer's down here, okay? So we'll have 40 seconds work and 20 seconds rest, but really make sure that when we do the cardio, you go absolutely flat out whatever the exercise is, and then when we do the toning and the, uh, the core exercises, make sure you slow it down and control. If you have yourself a mat, Please get it ready. If you haven't got a mat, don't worry. You can do this on the floor. If you're outside, do it in the grass, whatever, okay? Um, so what we're gonna do, do a warm up, and then we're gonna smash it, okay? So it's only 20 minutes, um, but you'll still get the same, probably, if not a better burn, calorie burn, than if when we do a hit step, trust me. Right, okay, so let's set our watches. Let's do this. So wrist rolls first, guys. Right, arms out in front. Chin to your chest, lean forward. Fantastic, arms behind, shoulder blades together, chest up. From there, let's do the arm circles. Uh, for those of you who don't know, we're doing a live hit step tomorrow outside at Sophie's, so if anybody wants to join in, please let me know. Good, 10 o'clock tomorrow morning it is, because we can't do it Friday because it's gonna be too hot again. <laughs> so from there, Feet shoulder width apart, we're gonna squat down, head and arms over one shoulder, rotate up to the ceiling. So yeah, live hit step. Outside tomorrow at 10 o'clock, so it'll be over on my CrossFit page. Two more. One more. Good, let's switch sides. So yeah, don't be coming on here tomorrow at 10 o'clock, because there won't be a hit step on here, it'll be on my CrossFit page, and it'll be accessed and live for everybody. Two more, and stop. Okay, from there, let's go into a squat, so nice, the squats, head up, chest up. So if any of you want to join us tomorrow, okay, let me know. Okay, you want to arrive between half nine and quarter to 10. Just uh, DM me, as they say, um, and we'll give you all the details. Okay, so from there, guys, we're just gonna leave the floor, do some jumping squats. If you can't leave the floor, go to tiptoes. You ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Let's leave the floor. Again, if you can't leave the floor, go to tiptoes. Nice and high, nice and low. Just getting the heart rate up. Right, next one, we're gonna go into lunges. Three, two, one. So into your lunges, guys. Forward lunge. Okay, lean as far forward as you can. Good stuff. So really, make sure you take your time with these. Try and get your knee as close as you can to the floor. Okay, three more seconds. Two. One, okay, back into those jumping squats again, let's go. 10 more seconds, let's push it. Four. Five seconds, four, three, two, one, rest up. Right guys, we all know what we do. Oh, morning, we all know what we do, don't we? From here, we sit in and we pulse for 20 seconds. So feet are gonna be shoulder width apart. We're gonna sit in and we're gonna pulse it for 20. Are you ready? Three, two, one, so sit in. 
Okay, get your elbows off your knees. Make sure your head's up and you're looking forward. And pulse, get nice and low, come on. We're 10 seconds in. 10 to go, come on. Oh, here we go, five more seconds. Four, three, two, one, good. Oh, that gets your quads burning, doesn't it? From there, down to your side lunge, all your weight onto one side. Really open up your groin, stretch it out. Good, change sides. So keeping those legs nice and wide. Let's do those toe touches. Let's rotate through the shoulder. Let's go nice and quick. Okay, legs straight, power through the arms. Get the shoulders nice and loose, top of your back. Three, two, one, good stuff, right. Have those feet together. Curl yourself up into a ball. Okay, then pull back on the shoulder blades. Keep your heels on the floor. Keep your head and chest up. Always get nice and low. Okay, keep looking forward. Keep this going. Okay, three more. One, two, last one, and three. Good stuff, right, hamstrings. I'm gonna show you sideways on. Touch your toes, crouch down, and stand nice and tall. Try and keep your legs nice and straight. Good, and repeat, so crouch down again. In your own time, stand nice and tall. Good, so when you stand up, come up nice and slowly, guys. Good, try right into the hip rotation, knee up, out to the side, let's have three outwards. Three, good, then bring it back in. One, two, and three. Same other side, knee up, out to the side. One, two, and three, bring this back in. One, two, and three. Good, from there, let's walk up and down on the tiptoes. Get that stretch in your calf. Up and down. Okay, onto your heels, just switch it. Exactly the same, walk up and down your room. Good stuff, right, stay in one position, on your tiptoes, weight those heels, so rock in motion, forward and back, really feel that stretch when you go onto your heels. Let's go, three more, one, two, that's one. And three, good, few ankle rolls, four one way, three or four the other, same the other side. Okay, right guys, stick with me, I'm just gonna turn on. Stick with me and we're gonna go through a few of the exercises. So, first one we're gonna do is a 90 degree knee up crunch touch. It's probably a, an easier way of saying that, but it's easier in my head. So, okay, your legs are gonna be up, this is a core exercise, so your legs are gonna be up to 90 degrees which is about, what, there. So if you want to make this harder, take it down to 45. But try and keep your legs as straight as you can. So when your legs are up in that position, okay, your head touches the floor, then you're gonna come up and touch your hands underneath your leg. Okay, back down. Okay, leg, um, sorry, arms go wide, come up, down. So you can make it easier, because obviously you haven't got to stretch as far. If your legs are up, make it harder. Take them down to about 45 degrees. So you've got to stretch a little bit further forward, okay? So it's either 45 degrees to make it hard, 90 degrees to make it slightly easier, but your hands need to touch underneath your legs, okay? That's your first one. Tricep dips. Don't really work the triceps a lot when we do um, hit training. So this is the one, that this burns, okay? So you have your hands down by your side, okay? You're up almost like into a, bridge, into a bridge position, okay? Don't worry about obviously being in the bridge, you don't have to. So what you're gonna do, is your hands are gonna be facing forward, you're gonna dip down, back up, down, up, down, up. So almost like you have to get your hips up, and you're gonna be in a straight line doing the bridge, okay? So practice a couple with these, okay? If you have to stop, it doesn't matter. So get your bum all the way to the floor, push up, don't get to bend your arms, okay, up and down. If you want to make it a little bit harder, bring your hands a little bit closer to your bum. Actually, that makes it easier, all the way around. Further out, okay? If you want to make it harder, take your arms a little bit further behind you. Again, it's up to you. God, I can feel that already. Um, up to you, where you put your hands. Obviously, you want them quite far back and make sure they're flat on the floor. That's your tricep dips. dips. Um, then you've got a side lunge taps. So obviously, we've got the lunge, but we need to tap the floor. So if you can see that, 
don't know if you can see because I'm off out of shot, but you're down for a side lunge, heads up, you touch the floor, then you go down to the other side, touch it, touch side to side. So you're going down for a side lunge, but your hand is touching the floor, okay, and then you switch sides. So again, hand in the middle, down or down to the side, okay? The side lunge taps. You've got to make sure you touch the floor. That way you're really going to make sure you're doing a nice deep lunge. Um, I think that's pretty much it. Oh yeah, we've got Spider-Man lunges as well. So, if your kids are doing it with you, fantastic. So when you do a lunge, you're going to put your arm out in front and then you switch sides. So you have to do Spider-Man. Obviously you're not making the noises unless you want to. So you go lunge, arm out, lunge, arm out. Make sure your lunge is deep and your arm is out. Not only are you going to feel it in your legs, you're going to feel it in your lats as well because you're driving your arm forward. Um, then you've got normal sit-ups. Um, that's about it, I think. Uh, there it goes. Well, yeah, pretty much it. Everything else I can explain as and when. So, again, let's just do it, okay? 20 minutes, flat out, follow it at home. Okay, we're all going to do it live together. I'm trying to do this upside down, it's pretty hard. Um, we're going to do this together. The timer is going to be here, if I can find it. Da -da 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 -da. So, what are we doing here? 20... <sighs> Silly man. Right, so we've got 40 seconds work, 20 second rest. We're all going to do this exactly at the same time. The first exercise is going to be a pulse racer. We're really going to get the heart rate up. We're going to do 40 seconds of sprint, and it's going to be absolutely flat out, okay? So are you guys ready? Let's turn this up so you can all hear it. All do this together. Are you ready? In three... Two, one, so let's go. Flat out sprint, really gonna get the heart rate up. Do not pace it, because we haven't got to do any of these exercises again. 21 exercises, 40 seconds work, 20 rest, and we're done for the day. So put effort in every single exercise, come on. Sideways on, it looks like this, come on. Come on, knees up. Let's work hard, maximum effort. Come on. 20 minutes and you're done. So put the work in now, let's go. Keep pushing. Come on, let's work. Oh, wow, that got the heart rate up. Right, 20 seconds rest. Your second exercise, gonna be press ups. So whether you do on your knees, or you do a full one, okay? Make sure your hands go across your chest. You go all the way down, pause it, back up to the top, it's not a race. So if you do it on your knees, again, chest down, come up. If not, all the way down, all the way up. It's not a race, slow it down. Get that chest as low as you can. Hands across your chest, come on. Down and up. 40 seconds worth of press ups. It's not a race. Good, come on. I'll show you forward on that, so you can see. Chest down, hands wide. All the way down, all the way up. Good, guys, keep it going. Chest down, come on. Last one. Oh, that was good, I felt that. Slow and controlled, always works. Now we're into the bicycle crunches. So your hands are not behind your head. Okay, knee up to elbow, but make it slow. Two second hold each side. So really come up, feel it in your obliques. Woo, let's go. Breathe out the top. Don't let your heels touch the floor. Come on. Really rotate. Breathe out. Every time your knee comes up. Good. Slow and controlled. Come on. Feel it. Come on. Slow it down. Feel that burn. Let's go. That's one. Oh. God dear me. Right, from the bicycle crunches, we're now into those reverse lunges. So stand in one position, leg goes backwards, head and chest up, slow and controlled. Get that knee to the floor if you can. Woo. Right, I'll be ready. So head and chest up, core tight. Back leg goes backwards, okay? Really deep in those lunges. Slow, controlled. Again, it's not a race. Go deep, 
all the way down. Come on, head and chest up. Always look forward. Good, come on. Feel this in your legs. Okay, maintain your nice deep breath. Let's go, come on. Looking good, guys. Keep that rhythm. Come on, nice deep lunges. And again. Control these lunges, guys. Last couple. Last one. Yes, well done. Right, from there, we've got a full stretch crunch. So, legs are down straight, arms above your head, you bend your knees, you come up with it, okay? Full stretch at the bottom, breathe out at the top. Okay, full stretch crunch. Here we go, above your hands above your head. Bring your knees up, breathe out. Slowly down. Try to keep your heels, keep your heels off the floor. Put your head down, keep that tension on those core muscles. Slow, hold it. Couple of seconds, slow and controlled it. You get more out of it if you control it. Slowly down, keep your heels off the floor, come on. When it gets tough, you can put your legs down. Try not to. Keep it going. I'll oh, feel this now. Breathe out on the top, breathe in on the way down. Oh, God, I felt that one. Okay, now we're into mountain climbers. Now, it's up to you. You can set your own pace on this. You can go fast, slow. Just do not stop with these. So, full on mountain climbers. Are you ready? In fact, do it sideways. Right, mountain climbers, ready? Let's go. So, set your pace. I want your knees up to your chest. I want your weight forward. Come on. Bear in mind, you've got to do it for 40 seconds. So keep that weight forward, keep your body down, keep your bum down, come on. I want your knees into your chest, let's get that heart rate back up. Good stuff guys, keep going, don't stop. If it gets tough, you can slow it. Come on, stay low. Come on, feel it in your core. Oh. Yes. Right, into those squat kicks now. So I want your feet shoulder width apart. You're gonna squat, kick out in front. Deep squat, kick out in front, okay? Make that kick powerful. Deep squat, head and chest up for this. Woo! So, squat, kick out in front. Squat, kick. Get that kick high, come on. I want that kick up to your chest. Down, squat, kick it out. Come on, high kick. Deep with the squat, get that ass to grass, come on. All the way down. Kick down, bang, kick. Okay, deep squat, head and chest up. Last one out, keep going. Keep working, do what happened there. Keep going. Keep going for your squat kicks, come on. Time is still going, got malfunction. Keep going, your squat kicks. We're still there. Sorry about that guys. Do what happened there, it fell out. So from the squat kicks, we're into sprint punch. So knees up and you are punching, okay? Let's get that heart rate back up again. Woo, right, let's do this. Yeah. So sprint punches, let's go, come on, knees up. Come on, let's work now. Sideways, looks like this. Come on, knees up and you are punching. You go uppercuts if you want, okay? Doesn't matter as long as you're punching sideways. Do what you do. Uppercuts, punches forward, sideways, whatever. Come on. Maintain that tempo. Come on. Keep working. Knees up. Oh, come on. Oh. Jeez Louise. Right, from there, we're keeping the heart rate up. We're doing jumping burpees. Chest to the floor, down, up, jump. If you can't jump, just stand up. Right, here we go. Jumping burpees, come on. Oh. So, chest to the floor, up, and jump. Back down again. Chest to the floor, up, and jump. Come on. Chest down, burpee. 
jump, chest down, bend me. Keep it going, guys. Come on. Down, up. It's the cardio section. Come on. Keep the heart rate up. Let's work. If you don't jump, just stand up. Go on. Chest down. Good work, guys. Keep going. Oh, oh it's getting tiring. Come on. Oh, well done. Great effort. Two, three, four. Yeah. Nearly halfway, so 90 degree knee ups now. The one we practice. So knees up, touch your hands underneath. Done this one, we're halfway. Right, get your knees up. Straight if you can. Come up, back down. Come up. Hold it, two seconds at the top. Hands touching, fingertips. Get your legs out, come on. Make it harder, pull them out further. Oh, that's too hard. Come on. Head down every time. Bring your shoulder blades up when you come up. Keep it going. Last one. Maybe not, come on. And that's last one. That was hard. Ow. Right, we've got squat crossovers. So you're gonna do a squat, cross your legs. Squat, cross your legs. So crisscross. The squat's gotta be deep. So squat, cross your legs. Squat, cross. Squat, cross your legs. One in front of the other. Deep squat, come on. Get that bum all the way down. Deep squat, head up. Chest up, use those core muscles for balance. Squat, crossover. Deep squat, cross your legs. Deep squat, cross. Come on, head and chest up. Make sure your reps are good. Quality reps, come on. Deep, cross. Deep, cross, come on. Keep going. Last one. Yes. Oh. Right, here comes your tricep dips. So, bridge position, hands facing forward. Okay, just by your wife side, by your side. Feet on the floor, dip up. This is horrible, I hate this one. So, bridge, dip up. Get your bum down, bend your elbows. Okay, all the way down, all the way up. So get in that bridge, bend your elbows, dip down. Oh, come on, feel it in your triceps. Okay, keep your hands close. Down, up. Come on, down. Oh, oh this is burning. Squeeze at the top. Squeeze. Down. Bum touch the floor. Up. Bend the elbows. Up. Come on. Uh, keep this going. Come on. Bum down. Up. Bend your elbows. Fully extend at the top. Oh, God. Ow. Right, side lunge taps. So remember, tap, tap, tap. Gotta go wide with the lunge, okay? Deep lunge, deep lunge. You can even keep your legs wide if you want. Just go side to side. So bend your knee, bend your knee. Bend, touch the floor, head up, chest up. Bend your knee, come on. Really wide, lunge. Keep your legs wide, lunge it out. Bend one knee, other leg straight. Come on, feel this in your groin. Come on, touch near your toe. Come on, keep pushing. Feel this in your groin. Head up, look forward. Get that knee bending, get low, come on. And again, wow. Right, bridge toe touches. So, guys, you're in a bridge position, okay? Touch, whoa, the opposite side, touch. If you can't do that, just hold out a bridge, okay? But you're touching your opposite foot. Right, are you ready? So, quite low, touch, get your bum down for this one, touch. Hand to opposite foot, touch, okay? Slow, controlled, feel this in your triceps in your arm. 
Keep your bum low. Lift it up when you bring your foot up. Come on. Touch your toe. If you can't do this, just hold a bridge. So just do that if you can't touch your toes. Okay, I want the hips up. Come on. Really lean over. Come on, and again. And again. Reach up to your toe. Reach forward. Come on. And again. Touch your toe. Oh, well done, got further the triceps. Right, into a plank. So we're gonna bring that heart rate back down now. On a straight forward plank, on your elbows, weight forward, on your toes. Okay, and hold it, on a straight line. Let's face this way. So 40 seconds of plank, here we go. So weight forward, guys. I don't want any bums in the air. Slow and controlled breathing. Let's slow the heart rate back down, come on. Squeeze that core, get your bum squeezed together as well. Slow it down. Good, well done. Squeeze the core. Come on, maintain that straight line. You want your bums down. Breathe, deep breaths. Come on. Oh, that's a good plank, you felt that. Right, we've got a few left, so narrow press ups now. We're back into those triceps. So hand placement, down by your side. Okay, keep your elbows tucked in for this one. Don't flare them out wide. Okay, your elbows tucked into your side. Remember, slow and controlled press ups. So, hands in, elbows tucked in, chest down, all the way up. Keep those elbows tucked in. Okay, keep your hands wide but just keep your elbows tucked into your side when you go down. Don't flare them out. Come on. Ah. If you find it tough, exactly the same on your knees, okay? Elbows tucked in. And again, come on. Down, up. Really feel this in your triceps. Slowly down, get that chest all the way to the mat. Come up, oh. Come on, keep going. Burning, that's one. Well done, oh that was tough. So, we've got the alternate V-ups now. So V-up, left leg, right leg, come up for them both. So you reach in the middle. Oh mate, this is hard. So touch your left leg, touch your right leg. Let's go, so come up to it. Get your head off the floor. So, left leg, right leg. Then both, make sure your shoulder blades and head come off the mat every time you touch your feet or your shins. Again, slow, one, two, come up for the V, hold it, one, two, back down, slow, one, it's not a race, two, hold it, the V up for two seconds, one, two, back down, come on, one, two, Hold it at the top. Oh, well done. Right, two left. Well, three left. My bad. Right, Spider Man lunges. So you lunge and you Spider Man. And you change sides. Whoa. Balance is key for this one. Sideways on. Okay, let's do this. So lunge sideways. So deep lunge, arm out in front, switch sides. Okay, make sure you lunge and you balance. Okay, balance yourself, you've got to use your core when you twist sides. Okay, nice deep lunge, come on. Arm out in front, come on. Really push the arm forward. When you're lunging, come on. Let's go, quicken it up a bit now. Let's get the heart rate up, come on. Oh, legs have gone, come on. Oh, burns, keep going. Arm out in front. Push, that's one, oh my god, right, sit-ups, normal sit-ups guys, okay, feet on the floor, okay, come up, as high as you can, oh, I'm going to tuck my feet under the sofa for this one, oh. right, are you ready, sit-ups, 40 seconds, hands on the side of your head, and go down, come up, breathe out on the top, Good, and again. 
back down, back up. Breathe out at the top, slow and controlled. Come up all the way. Back down again. Keep your heels on the floor. Come back down. Head all the way down, shoulders down. Bring it all up together. Head up, chest up. Look forward when you do the sit up. Come on. Last one. Oh. Oh. Right, guys. We're into our final exercise. Okay. We're going to do, let's stop that, a side plank crunch. So, we've done these ones before. It's your final exercise for one minute. So, 30 seconds on each side. You've done a side plank. You're going to crunch your knee up. So, bring your knee to the elbow for one minute. All right, are you guys ready? Timer's on, side plank. If you can't bring your knee up, just hold out a side plank, okay? Are you ready? Three, I need to face this my way now, if I can see. Three, two, one. Right, side plank, let's get in it. Side plank up, knee. Okay, knee up to your elbow, so you're crunching. So bring it up. Good, knee up. Try and keep that straight line. Tough. If you can't do the knee up, just hold the side plank, come on. Ah, let's crunch. You put your hand on your head if you like. Make it even harder. Four seconds. Change sides. Let's go, final 30. Come on, let's do this. Put your hand on your head. One hand on the side of your head. Bring that knee up to the elbow. Straight lines, come on, it's tough. Breathe out when your knee comes up, come on. Side crunch. If you can't do it, just hold it. Come on. Oh, it's getting tough. Push it. Oh, well done, guys. Oh, that was horrible. 20 minutes. Absolutely smashed that. Oh, guys. I've got sweat on now. Oh. That was good, I enjoyed that. 20 minutes. Oh, certainly got the heart rate up, that's for sure. 300, look at that, still beat burnt. 310 calories in 20 minutes, okay? So, you see what I mean about burning the calories because you're going slower in some of the exercises. Okay, you're depleting your body of oxygen because you're really working hard even though you're going slower. Not on all of them, obviously, because the heart rate did go up. We did a few cardio exercises, but it's not about the speed, it's about the control of the reps, and getting, most importantly, getting the exercise right, okay? I always say to all my clients, every rep you do, make it like it's your last one, okay? So, from your first rep to your last, try and keep it consistent throughout the whole time or the whole rep range, depending on how how it works for you, okay? Well done, guys. Oh, wish I was doing this workout day. You still can, Ash, if you want the link. No problem, I can send the link to you. You can do this whenever you like. Mm. Well done, crew. Awesome effort. That was good. A good strength in work. Feel it in my triceps with the press-ups. That was good, I enjoyed that, so I hope you did too. Again, just because you're not feeling beasted, and you're on the floor collapsed in a heap and you're breathing out your ass, excuse me, doesn't mean that you've not done a workout because I still feel it. Okay, I've still burnt the calories. Well done. Well done, Jan. Awesome. Well done, guys. High fives, fist pumps. You rock, as always. Okay, do you remember if you want to do this workout again, by all means, ask for the link and I can send it to you. Hats off to all of you. Okay, so it's a really good workout in between doing the high intensity hit classes, I think. So I feel it in my core today, definitely. So again, a couple of new exercises in there for you guys. Really good, focus on the core strength, as well as a bit of upper body in there as well. So guys, well done, awesome work. Right, just to re uh, recap, tomorrow's session is gonna be an outdoor hit step. If anybody wants to join us, you know, the crew, you've seen the videos, by all means, anybody is welcome, okay? It's not set to three or four people or 10 people. It's for everybody on this group. So 
if anybody wants to do a live hit class, um, by all means, get in touch with me and I'll point you in the right direction for tomorrow. It's at 10 o'clock, as it always is. We aim to get there between half nine and quarter to 10. Um, but it won't be on this channel, okay? It's gonna be on my Chris Fit page. You know, I usually do these on Fridays, but the last couple of weeks, and obviously this week as well, is gonna be so hot, we're um, bringing it forward for a couple of days. So, no workout on here tomorrow. It'll be over on the Chris Fit page, and it's accessible to everybody. Again, I'll leave it on there so you guys can do the workout as many times as you want. So, if you guys wanna join in, just again, let me know, and we'll uh, arrange to get you involved tomorrow morning. Good stuff, right. Let's stretch out. So, quad stretch first, guys. Heel up to your bum. Woo. Good stuff. Right, let's switch sides. Awesome stuff. Right, let's uh, elevate the toes. Stretch out the calves, so whether it's on your sofa or a chair or anything, push your toes up, heel on the floor, body weight forward. Okay, switch sides. Okay, good stuff. Right, from there guys, we're gonna sit on the floor for this one. Put your leg out in front. Okay, the other leg tucked into your thigh. I want you to lean and stretch forward for this one. Hold that stretch. If you can touch your toes, amazing, because I can't. Good, switch sides. So guys, feedback. Please, when you post your pictures or your videos, let me know how you found it. Was it not long enough? Was it not challenging enough? Okay, I always get paranoid when I make these classes up that I'm not uh, working you guys hard enough. So could you let me know? That'd be great. Awesome, right, let's have your feet together. So tuck your feet in as far as you can, close to your body. Want your knees out wide, elbows tucked into the side of your knee, push out and down and we're gonna lean forward and then we're gonna breathe out. So are you ready? One, two, three, lean forward, breathe out. Okay, maintain your normal breath. So lean forward whilst pushing your knees down towards the floor. Three, two, one. Okay, bring those knees in close together. And we're gonna repeat. So as before, count down to three and then we're gonna breathe out. Three, two, one, breathe out. Lean forward, pull your hips down, pull your knees down. Come on. Three, two, one. Good stuff, guys. Excellent. Right, when you stand up, come up nice and slowly. So I'm going to show you this one sideways on. We're going to go into a lunge, but I want your back knee on the floor. We're going to rock forward and back for 10. On the last one, we're going to reach forward and touch the floor. Let's go. Forward and back. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Right, lean forward as far as you can as touch the floor. Really hold it, hold that stretch. Three, two, one. Great stuff. Right, let's switch sides. Right, let's start rocking. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Right, reach forward, stretch, hold it out, maintain it. Three, two, one. Good. Right, when you stand up again, guys, come up nice and slowly. Reset yourself. Good. Right, let's have your hand down the middle of your spine. Push down on top of the elbow. Really need this stretch after those triceps. Good, let's switch sides. Oh. 
Okay, from there, let's have your hands locked out above your head. Let's lean your body weight over to one side. Okay, back into the center and repeat the other side. From there, let's have your hands out in front, chin to your chest. Good, arms behind, shoulder blades together. Really squeeze the shoulder blades. Let's have your chest up. Good, okay, last one, arm across your chest. Pull it in nice and tight. Okay, switch sides. Fantastic work, guys, you're all done. Brilliant, well done for today. Again, just to recap, we're back on Chris Fit tomorrow for live hit step. Please, if you can join us, please to let me know. Um, that's it for today. Again, back for hit step tomorrow. Love you all. Um, still got a good workout, still burning calories. I finished at 377. That includes, obviously, the warm up as well. So, well done, crew, and have a great day, and we'll see you tomorrow. Love you all. Bye.